Wow. Video of a disturbing confrontation with police. What did she do? It's a disturbing video going around social media, and skaters who use this park say it involves a girl who was taken down that's living with developmental disabilities. They're asking for an apology. They say the girl was given a sobriety test before she was eventually let go. A warning some viewers may find images in this story disturbing. It started with a confrontation. Kermalik Skateboards was hosting its first competition at the Southwood Skate Park on Saturday. Hundreds were also gathered for a baseball game and the annual rhubarb festival. And I was going pretty fast, so I warned him. I said, hey, get out of the way. I yelled really loud. More people were yelling at the officer to get out of the way of competitors. Mr. Ossifer, we cannot have this. Hey, we got a contest going on here, Mr. Ossifer. Witnesses say the officer tried to arrest someone. Another guy came over and kind of pushed the cop off him, said you can't do that, he's not doing anything. Cop pulled out his weapon and started chasing him around the baseball diamond. Came back around, the guy, I don't know where he went, the cop came up to the crowd of people again and started trying to arrest another guy. Chusik says it was frightening to watch. The little guys like that look up to all the older guys in the skateboard community as we're out here every day doing tricks, that kind of thing. And um, a lot of the younger kids looked pretty scared, you know, there's to see one of somebody they look up to getting chased by what they could be a gun. They had no idea. It looked like a gun to me. The skaters who spend their time here say they know the 14 year old girl well. She comes to this park every day to draw. She comes up to the skateboarders and says, you know, look what I drew. And, you know, everyone's pretty aware of her disabilities around here. So. You know, they welcome her with open arms. And what did she do? They were holding her down. They were actually accusing her of being drunk and intoxicated. They were searching through her stuff, asking her if she where her liquor was, basically publicly humiliating her, making her walk a straight line. Calgary police say several officers responded to an emergency backup call, and the girl in the video was told several times to step back. CPS says body camera footage shows the girl swearing and lunging towards an officer. In a statement, CPS says the girl was subsequently taken to the ground by two female officers. As she was being escorted away from the scene, the girl's mother was located. She provided the age and circumstances of the girl who was then released without charge into the custody of her parent. As with all use of force encounters, this will be reviewed in full to determine all the circumstances. Tusik says the family has told him they're still traumatized by the incident and they weren't ready to speak on camera just yet. He was told the daughter has injuries on her neck and back and is afraid to go out. In Calgary, Crystal Adaris, City News.